Good morning, guys. It's uh, let's see, Thursday, May seventh, two thousand twenty. Um, let's see. We start Thursdays with the sushi sushi pay. So go ahead and uh, let's see. Stand up, face the crucifix, face me, or bow your head and close your eyes. In the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. My God, I am yours for time and eternity. Teach me to cast myself entirely into the arms of your loving providence with the most lively, unlimited confidence in your compassionate, tender pity. Grant, O most merciful Redeemer, that whatever you ordain or permit may be acceptable to me. Take from my heart all painful anxiety. Suffer nothing to sadden me but sin, nothing to delight me but the hope of coming to the possession of you, my God and my all, in your everlasting kingdom. Amen. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen. Go ahead and get your packets out for Thursday, May 7th, and let's talk about what we're going to do today. Well, in math, we're doing the Chapter 11 review, so make sure that you complete that first before you, uh, before you watch the video. Make sure you complete it fully um, from page 761 all the way through the Reflect on page 764. Um, make sure you show your work on a separate sheet of paper. Make sure that if you are doing conversions and it is asking you for yards to inch, or for, for yards to inches, make sure you go to feet first. Same with capacity. If, it's, if it gives you gallons and it's asking you for cups, don't forget you have to go from gallons to quarts, then to pints, then to cups. Don't forget that because you will be counted off for that on the review and on your test because you must go, because if you're trying to go from inches to yards, you're not gonna be able to divide by 36. And if you're trying to go from cups to gallons, you're not gonna be able to divide by 16. You're not gonna know how to divide large numbers by numbers by two digit numbers. We have not done that yet this year. We have not done that this year. So make sure that you are going between. Make sure you're showing all work. Uh, make sure you are showing work correctly, and then make sure that once you're ready to watch the video, your pencils and erasers are put completely away so that you are not tempted to cheat, and you only have your red pen out. Um, after the review, we'll do. you'll have reading. We're going to read a new story, um, Poseidon in the Kingdom of Atlantis. Some of you I know will be really excited about this. Um, and then we're going to talk about protagonists. So we're going to talk about who the protagonist is in the story, and then we're going to review a little bit about the figurative language hyperbole. And then in religion, um, we're going to do a review of chapter 11, as well as a tour of the church. Um, so go ahead, get started. You can do this in any order. Um, just make sure that you do complete it all, and go ahead and get started right now. Oh, I forgot. Those of you who are actually watching this video, you have another chance for two extra points. On your reading assignment right here next to the directions for the first part I want you to draw the American flag doesn't have to have all 50 stars just draw the American flag I just saw it over there so that's what reminded me and you will get two extra points so if you're actually watching this you get a chance for two extra points just draw that American flag um, do not tell anybody. Make sure that you have done what the video told you to do yesterday and what the video on um, Tuesday told you to do. I'm not going to say it now. Um, so that you can have a chance for some extra points. Okay, go ahead and do that right now before you forget. And then go ahead and get started. <laughs> 